I know guys, I need to start wearing my hair down. Anyways, welcome my lovelies. Um, tonight we're going to do an unboxing of doo -doo -doo -doo, my April. Let me fix this a little bit. Hold on guys. Is that better? My April um, boxy charm. So we're gonna make that happen tonight. Um, I I chose for my choose item, like my choose item, I chose for the palette one of the Zoeva or Z something palette. I can't remember, but I did choose for a palette. So we might just do a look tonight. Even don't know yet. We are just playing it by ear. All right, a couple touch points. I get the base box. Um, let me pull up what I know. Okay, there's a premium box. I'll put the price on the screen. I did not do my research. I forget. I think it's like because the base box went up and they came out with a premium box. I'm sure you guys know that. But anyways. Um, actually, today is my choose item, so I'll be right back. I'm going to go choose my item before it's too late. I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. I wanted to go and make sure I had all my ducks in a row, and I knew what I was talking about, but, um, anyways, I got the base box, and plus I had to go order my add-ons and all that, but there really wasn't much in there that I wanted this month, so... I didn't check out I just put in what I wanted in my car and hopefully I'll get it because tomorrow they should be adding more stuff to it they'll add to it for like a 48 hour period so where I'm a base box I don't know if this works for everybody but I get um, my choice item and my add-on items between the 14th and the 15th, but the 14th is when it starts. Sorry guys, I've got a broken nail. Say a little prayer for it, okay? Anyways, no, seriously. Um, anyway, so let's open this up. And let's see what's in here. Let's see what we got. We probably won't be doing a look after all tonight with it because it is late and I just wanted to get on here and unbox this with you guys so you guys could definitely, um, you know, see what I got. Duh. All right, let's see. This is Boxy Charm Festival Vibes. That's what it's called. Oh, because of Coachella. I get it. Oh, don't want to look at it. Don't want to look at it yet. Okay, let's see. What else do we got? We've got. Oh. I wish I would have gotten that in my box. Well, anyways, it's a coupon to get 20% um, off of a makeup eraser. To get a makeup eraser. It's a coupon for that. So, yeah, there we go. There we have that. So, we know I didn't get that if I don't have Maybe I would have gotten that otherwise. I don't know. All right, first thing I see here that I want to grab is these Burlington lashes. Burlington, I think that's the name of them. It's got like, it almost looks like an owl to me. I love these lashes. I got them in a previous box, but obviously not the same pair. They're not going to send me the same exact pair. Oh, definitely not. This one comes with a little glue in it. How super freaking cute. And they're real pretty. Ooh, they're real pretty. Okay, so there's that. There's some lashes. Just saying. I hope I like those. Um, and then I've got the Poor Fashional. Okay, it's the hydrating primer, so it's not the normal Benefit Professional. This is the hydrating. That might be too bright, actually, guys. Let me hold this up until I figure it out, because I don't want it to glare off of things. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry, guys. Okay, is that better? So, I've got the Professional 
hydrating. Let's see if I can get it to focus where it says hydrating. It's a hydrating. Anyways, I got that. That's super cool. Heck yeah. I love trying new primers. Oh, oh, I've been wanting these. I actually got these in a... Oops, this is kind of telling you guys a little sneak peek, but I've got another box to unbox, and I got... So this makes... I've got two little ones now of this. Sorry. This is the Hank and Henry sponges. They are a neon green, and they, the one that I do know that I have, it was this, um, I unboxed, this is before I started my channel though, I unboxed a mystery box from, um, Valentine's Day from Hank and Henry, there was only a few of them, and, um, well, I don't even know if it's a mystery box, I guess it was, but, um, basically, I ordered this mystery box full of new items that they was getting ready to add to their website and I got first dibs on them like a influencer would but I paid for it instead of gotten it for free that's that's basically what that was anyways this is it dry it's got the little owl the Hank and Henry um, symbol let me see gosh it's this isn't the right lighting it can't be the right lighting hold on Whoa, we're orange, guys. <laughs> Maybe that's better. There we go. Yeah, so there you go. That's the Hank and Henry sponge. I'm guessing that's for like the, you know, that's super cool. I actually like this. Um, and then here's the baby one. I wonder if it's got the owl on it, too. Oh, the baby one doesn't have the owl. But here's the baby one. Matches my nails. Perfect. Even though my nails are not green, in this light it looks like they match. My nails always look like they're either green or yellow. It's really weird. So anyways, we got the Hank and Henry sponges. That's super cool. Can't wait to use those. We Now listen, just because I'm not doing a look tonight don't mean I'm not going to do a look at all. I am going to do a look, I promise. Um, I've still got to do a look with my other mystery unbox. Actually, the boxes are just piling up. So I wanted to get this done. Um, okay, so it looks like the next item that I have in the box is going to be these lavish brushes. Let's check them out. Okay. Let's see. So, here's, whoops. Oh, gosh, I can't hold them. Ah! Okay. <laughs> anyway, so... That's a cool blending brush. And then you've got your, you can either use it. This is actually probably an eyebrow brush because it's got this spoolie at the end. Here is a nice, super thin eyeliner brush for like gel eyeliners. I needed this because for some reason I don't have one. Pretty weird out of all the brushes that I own. Um, and then we have the pencil brush like you know for like up under the eye and what I really like about these is they look like they're stained with these colors even though they're definitely not stained they're fresh out of the box so that's actually really freaking cool even this one has a yellow tip to it so that's really cool so there's your bullet brush like basically for precision either in the outer corner or even in the crease that would work really good um it works really good under the eye to get the initial color under the eye and then this one is your regular eyeshadow brush you know what you could use it for packing you could use it for blending too if you want like in the crease area but anyway so yeah there you go we've got these brushes and this one's got this at the end you can never get enough spoolies just saying so that's real cool oh let's see and then the last item in my box oops i just dropped two of them i'll pick them up in a minute the last item in my box is the zoeva Zoeva, Zoeva, I'm really not sure how to pronounce that. Eyeshadow palette. Now, this I know was a various color scheme. Um, there was various 
palettes that you could pick but you couldn't pick one in particular you could either pick a palette on my choose date last month like I just got done doing my choose date for next month so I chose my item for next month and I added on my items for next month but I always get them this month so keep that in mind I don't you know and I also have a link for you guys to get a discount either you'll get a discount or you'll get a free uh, free item um, I don't know if it's of your choice or not but you'll get a free item for being a new member coming under my link so I'll post that down in the bottom below so you guys can actually if you don't already have it you can you know even if you do have it and you want to dip you want to you know go through my link you can always start under a different one and drop your other one if you want to that way so you can get a free item of the of that month for your for your startup but anyway so I got this one which is it's really pretty let me turn a little bit more light on for a minute is that too bright see I feel like that's so bright anyways this one is going to be scream queen that's the name of it scream queen right there scream queen okay let's and then you slide it out so that's pretty cool but it came inside of plastic as well that's awesome that's comforting um i did pause you guys for a minute when i paused you guys to do my add-on and to do everything else i want you guys to know that i use my disinfectant spray and I use my disinfectant wipes to kind of just do a quick wipe down just just because you know it's scary getting packages from another place not knowing you know the obvious um, let's look sorry my hair is just so much to handle all right so I will probably either put this in a giveaway or I will probably sell it one or the other more than likely put it in a giveaway um this isn't me this just isn't for me i'm not gonna break the spine of it i'm not going to do any swatches because as of right now i definitely don't want it um it's just not for me uh but otherwise it's really beautiful i mean it's super pretty it looks like I don't know it really looks like you only got one mat in here there's one mat right here and then this one looks like it could be a mat but it's not like it's definitely not a foil like like some of these but this is super pretty and like very valentiny but festival theme I just don't I don't see the festival theme in it um, maybe that's just me but to me when i think of festival i think of bright colorful crazy innovative you know this definitely doesn't seem on theme to me but um there's the little covering the plastic cover it says zoeva on it or zo zoeva yeah it's gotta be that anyways there's that um super pretty i definitely think it's gorgeous but i when i do colors i like you'll see you'll see my taste you'll see it because i'm gonna start doing more makeup videos the only reason why i haven't been doing makeup videos is because even though i have this mirror right here to the side of me i don't want to be looking to the side I want to have a mirror on my desk maybe that I can look into and I, I hate the little mirrors because I feel like I'm gonna screw up my whole face if I use a little mirror so with that being said that's my explanation to why I haven't done a makeup look yet and that's why all my makeup video ideas I've got a whole journal like a whole book I'll show you guys actually hang on I've got a whole binder this is devoted to YouTube and YouTube ideas. Like, I keep track of my subscribers. I keep track of everything on here outside of, you know, the app that we download. So, this has a crap ton of ideas, guys. And I'm just kind of, I'm waiting for a few things. I'm waiting for my audio to get here and um, a mirror to get here so I can actually look into a bigger mirror. I'm blind as a bat. 
obviously, hence to why I always have glasses on my head, because if I didn't have them on my head, I would be lost without them, because I need them. Um, so yeah, with that being said, that's that. That's the reason why I haven't done a makeup look. So be ready, guys. I'm going to leave everything in its box. That way, so when I get my mirror and my audio, I can go ahead and start pushing out some makeup looks for you guys. Um, you don't get to see that side of me yet because I haven't really had the opportunity to give you guys that. Um, I love makeup. I know semi what I'm doing. I'm not no pro professional by any means, but I definitely love makeup. I'm very much so a makeup enthusiast and... I just, I love it. I love it. So, um, yeah, with that being said, uh, I, I, well, blah, blah, blah. Anywho, let's, um, calculate this up. All right, guys, I got my calculator and I've got my little sheet of paper that tells me all the prices. Um, remember, I am the base box, okay, guys? I'm the base box. So, for the Benefit Cosmetics um, Hydro Primer, it's going to be $32. And then the Zoeva Eyeshadow Palette is $28. And then the Hank and Henry Sponge Set is $20. And then the Lavish five piece neon eye brush set is $29.99 why not just say 30 but okay I guess people would probably complain about that because that's what people do anyways um and then the lashes are $31 okay so my monthly total sorry the screen is cracked on this phone but I'll show you it's $140.99 do you see that $140.99 overlook the cracked screen and the ratchet fingernail <laughs> anyway so yeah um, that was my box total that's actually not that bad because I paid 27 for my entire box um, so, yeah, there's that damn paint in my hair again. I'm trying to hide it. I've washed it. I've done everything I know to do. You see it, and it will not come out. Thanks, wall vanity. Anyway, so, also, I was noticing uh, boxy perks of the month. Misguided, cute, close, seek, wearers. Uh, so, in other words, like, cute clothes need us is what basically it says anyways next level fashion twelve dollars from twelve dollars and up misguided.com um they gave me a code that is valid until the 15th of next month and i can get 55 percent off my next order on misguided i just might do that so guys be ready be ready because I might do that and we'll even do a try on haul. I'm all about that. So there is a few touch points that I want to talk about on this box. First and foremost, the eyeshadow palette was definitely not on scene for the festival scene. Um, it was definitely dulled down. I don't uh, every time I think of festival, I think of bright, beautiful, vibrant, you know, um, and it always has been until now. I, I, I don't know if it's because of everything going on. They just felt like they could get away with it. I really don't know, but it doesn't seem very festival-y to me. This palette alone, it should have been bright. They should they shouldn't have even had a choice between such of a much, I don't know, I don't know. It, for some people, maybe, but for me, no. I made it very clear to them that I love color, vibrant. I love color. They're, I can't get enough color, and I said that on my quiz, so you would think that they would have done a little bit better in that area, but that's okay. It's okay. Someone else out there will love it. Um, so that's one item that's going into my um, next bin of giveaway. I've already got a bin started, and I'll do a couple giveaways. Um, 
Also, this this definitely the little sponge set. It's neon green. It's got cute neon green packaging. Like the packaging itself is neon green, as you see. So yes, this definitely is on point with the festival vibes. This is definitely on point with the festival vibes. And it's a lavish brush set brush set. I've never tried it, but I'm I'm happy to when I get a chance to. The eyelashes, I mean, that's an everyday thing. So you can say, hey, this is festival. Um, but I know at festivals, they would rather have much bigger, you know, you know how girls be doing it, including myself. They like to put them big old gawky eyelashes on. Um, and I call them gawky because that's what they are, but I love them as well. So I'm not dogging them by any means. This doesn't really, these aren't, these aren't as big as you would expect them to be for like the festival theme. I think their theme this month was, could have been awesome and um, definitely should have been a little bit more on theme than, than they was. The only real thing that fits the theme in this box out of one, two, three, four, five items is two items and possibly the third one, which is the eyelashes. So... To me, I feel like they kind of fell off the bandwagon, but I don't want to give them too much of a hard time because we all are going through something major right now, so I, I'm understanding. Um, and we will be doing a look with this, with some of these items, not all of it, because I, like I said, the palette is going to go into the giveaway bin. Um, so, or the, yeah, the giveaway bin. So with that being said, um, I will, how about I will mix this in with another look that I have in my binder, my little binder, my handy dandy binder, and um, make it happen that way. We'll use what I do, what I will use out of this with something else, just kind of like a mixed review on all items that I've never tried maybe. Um, but either way, with that being said, there's my April box. Overall, do I think it's worth it? Yes. Um, I wish I would have gotten a better eyeshadow palette. I, I like the lashes. I'm okay with the lashes. I'm not going to know Coachella, so it's okay that it's not 100% on theme, but otherwise, yeah, I like it. Um, they definitely did all right, but they definitely could have done better this, this month. Like, I'm definitely disappointed, and I'm kind of disappointed with the add-ons, too. That's why I didn't completely check out, um... Yeah, like I, I, I mean, I get it. We're all going through it, but they're not, they're not, they're not slow to taking our money, even though we're all going through this situation. So I feel like, even more so now than ever, they should be innovating their themes better, and they definitely should be, um, you know, more, more driven to make sure that we're happy. Because we're spending money with them when over half of the world is laid off, including myself. So, BoxyCharm, if you are watching me by any chance, just know that I love you guys to death. That's why I continue to stick it out with you guys and, you know, work through this. But anyways, with that being said, maybe you guys could take a little bit more consideration to the situation and put a little bit more time into your boxes you know, uh, especially in a time like now. Um, this is not very festival-y at all. The only two things that, and, and possibly three, like I've already stated, but either way, it is what it is. Am I happy with the box? Yes, and nine times out of 10, I am happy with the box. Um, I will leave my link in the description. I mean, 144 or $140, whatever it was, you can't beat that for 25 bucks. So I'm just saying, go sign up under my link. You'll get a free um, item of whatever. I think sometimes they let you choose, sometimes they don't. But either way, you'll get a free item that you guys could get added on to your monthly subscription. And like I said, it's only like $25. Or they might even give you a discount and a free item. I really don't know... I will try to figure that out for you and put that in the description along with my link so you guys can sign up for BoxyCharm with my link and get the free item or the free item and discount, whichever one it is. 
Either way, it's still a good deal if it's one or the other, or even if it's both, it's even a better idea or deal. Get it together, Megan. Anyways, um, so yeah, overall, I'm very excited. I love my box. And um, with that being said, I also got a good item to give out to my lovelies. Um, so yeah, I'll be back soon and we will be doing another mystery unbox. It's a subscription box. Um, it's from the Makeup Institute. I will also be unboxing that probably tomorrow maybe. I might even do it tonight just to kind of do it and be ahead of myself. Um, but I do have several unboxings that I need to do. So I wanted to go ahead and push this out though because I know everybody loves and wants Boxy Charm and, and who doesn't have it needs to have it. It is actually worth it. I mean, you just seen for yourself. I got five full, full size items and it was almost a full face. All I was missing was foundation and concealer and powder. That's it. So like for 25 bucks, I got 140 to 144 dollars worth of stuff. If you ask me, it's worth it. So like, you know what, guys? Um, before I end it out, this is just afterthought. I noticed this month it doesn't have the variation anywhere on it. I've been looking this whole time, and for some reason, this is the very first time. Oh, there it is. Variation 28. There she is. Hold on. Right there, guys. Let me see if I can focus it. See it right there? Variation 28. Okay, so wow, that's a really high up variation. Let me refocus now. Okay, that's a really high up variation. Wow. I'm normally like variation one or two, so that's pretty high. Um, but I was also looking at this. For everybody that already is subscribed to BoxyCharm, if you don't subscribe under me, if you already are subscribed, um, just in case you didn't get this paper, because I know last month my box came with no papers, missing items. It was pretty crazy, but they fixed it. I give them that. Um, anyways, uh, May 12th is when they open up the Boxy pop-up. Um, for the Luxie box, it's $49.99 every three months you get one, and they're giving me a sneak peek on what's going to be in there. Kylie's skin's going to be in there, possibly is going to be a variation. Tarte eyeshadow palette, big variation, which is nice. Actually, it's really big. And then Swell, like the cup, um, the the bottle right here the like little bottle and then for the boxy pop-up there's a glam glow um paracone md benefit which is an eyebrow thing boxy bay uh curler for your hair and then Too faced pretty and rich i think um eyeshadow palette is just like a sneak peek of what you'll be getting in the pop-up so yeah um like i said i'm gonna leave you guys my um direct link for you guys to do that and i'm sorry that i came back on just to tell you this but i wanted to because i forgot to touch base with that so now you know my variation was 28 which is really high up so i'm sure the lower ones are going to be better than mine um, but I'm okay with what I got. I like what I got. Maybe the lower ones are more on theme with the festival. I don't really don't know. But either way, um, yeah, I'm like really excited to be sharing this with you guys. And I hope to see some of you guys that are not signed up sign up. I would love that. I don't make anything off of it, by the way. I would tell you. I don't make anything off of it. I'm not an affiliate with BoxyCharm. I am simply just a BoxyCharm subscriber. That's all. Um, subscription box. That's all I do with BoxyCharm. I do not get paid at all. I'm no type of affiliation. Nothing. So, I just wanted to do my unboxing with you guys and give you the knowledge I know and show you which I, what I got because I like to watch them myself. Also, um, yeah. Until next time, for real this time, I will talk to you then. 
So yeah, subscribe to me and become part of my crew and um, talk to me, leave comments. I'm in my comments. I'm definitely heart in comments. I respond to people. I'm definitely here to, to try to make you guys' day just a little bit better, even if it's just a little. Um, but anyways, guys, until next time, bye, my lovelies. Alright guys, so anyways, back to what I was saying is I okay, so hair. Like look at this paint in my hair. What the heck? Really? And I'm on camera right now being like, oh look at my hair. What? Well, I'm probably gonna have to cut that out because it didn't come out in the shower. Wonder much more than there. Anyways, anyways, let me go ahead and get out the calculator, and um, yeah, we will add this crap up. No, seriously. Oh man, I messed up. <sighs> Start over, retake. Okay guys, I've got my little handy dandy calendar. All right, so for the Zoeva palette, wait, wait, no, the Benefit Cosmetic Professional Soothing, Professional Hydrating Primer is $32. And then for the eyeshadow palette, it's $28. And then the Hank and Henry um, sponges are, $20 and then the lavish five piece neon eye brush set which to me the only thing that was really off theme hold on anyways those are $29.99 plus $20.99 all right, plus, all right, and then the lashes with the little glue, um, with the mini glue are $31. Holy crap, anoli. $31 equals my total box. That's not right. That can't be right. $320. So we did something wrong. Hold on. Alright guys, got my calendar, got my little book, we're going to add this up. Um, okay, so for the benefit, 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 